Hello and welcome to GSC at Home. My name is Sapa and today, along with some of the lovely people in the Glasgow Science Centre, we're going to tell you some weird, cool or gross animal facts. So, here's some facts you may be interested to know. Hippos are very large mammals. In fact, they're the third largest land mammal after the elephant and the white rhino. They have a large cylinder-like body with short legs and a humongous head. A fully grown hippo can weigh up to 4,500 kilograms. That's the same as three small cars. However, despite their enormous size, hippos can still run faster than humans, galloping in at 19 miles per hour, whereas humans max out at 8 to 10 miles per hour. When a rat is tickled, it will giggle ultrasonically. Scientists know that rats love to be tickled, especially on their backs and their bellies. When tickled, rats let out teeny tiny giggles that are too high pitched for us to hear. Scientists have managed to capture these giggles on special microphones so that we can hear them. The rats love this so much that they chase the scientists' hand around looking for more tickles. They even like to jump and frolic when tickled in a newly discovered behaviour called joy jumps. How cute is that? The gibbon, the only lesser ape in the ape family, is perfectly designed for swinging through trees. They have a ball and socket joint in their wrist. Just like we have in our shoulder, the ball and socket joint in a gibbon's wrist helps the mobility, the movement of the joint to facilitate that swinging through the trees. They also have incredibly long arms, so they can stretch from branch to branch. Their arms are so long that if a gibbon stood on two feet, like we do, their arms would stretch all the way to the ground. How long is that? One of the stealthiest animals on the planet is the polar bear. And not just because its white fur blends in with the snowy backgrounds, but also it really doesn't show up on infrared camera. This is because infrared cameras are looking for a loss of heat in polar bears they're an expert of retaining their heat. They've got a thick layer of blubber, as well as that dense white fur, which is gonna stop them releasing any heat, making them very hard to spot on an infrared camera. A town in China used something a little less conventional to help their police force. Rather than using police dogs as guards, they use police geese. Geese are actually very fearless, vigilant, and extremely noisy animals, so make for good police guards. Birds also have excellent vision, so can see objects at a greater distance in much clearer detail than humans can, so are able to alert police of any intruders that are much further away. The way cats' vocal cords are shaped means that if a cat can purr, it can't roar. So that means your cat at home can purr, but will never be able to roar like a lion. And a lion will never be able to purr like your cat at home. The coolest part comes when you realize that cheetahs purr. And it means that they'll never roar. And in fact, cheetahs meow just like our cats at home. If you're looking for an animal with real punching power, you may be thinking about some of the heavyweights out there like a gorilla, or maybe even a kangaroo, which is pretty famous for doing some punches. However, if you want to find a creature that punches well above its weight, you need to head under the sea and look out the mantis shrimp. The mantis shrimp, although coming in at only about 10 centimeters long, may lack the reach, but it certainly has the punching power. It manages to punch at speeds of up to 23 meters a second. That's a lot faster than heavyweight boxers, which tend to only come in at around 15 meters a second. And as for force, even the shock wave produced by one of its punches comes in at around about 1,500 newtons. That is a hefty punch that is gonna be a knockout blow. Most cockroaches have wings, but they don't use them to fly. They use them to fall with style, like Buzz Lightyear and that is because they can run really fast. Cockroaches run 1.5 meters a second, which is incredibly fast. If you scaled that up, that would be the equivalent of a human running 200 miles an hour. Also, like most other insects, they breathe through their skin, which means that if they get decapitated, they can live for up to a week afterwards. Gross. <laughs> 
Thank you for joining us at GSC at home today. If you've got any cool, weird or gross animal facts, then please let us know down in the comments and we'll see you tomorrow at 10am.